you know, here. Coming back for more armor stuff. So we built the armor, and it works, right? That's cool. Uh, some things that I did while on my downtime, things that, I mean, it's not really relevant uh, in terms of your learning, but I went ahead and added registry, uh, or registry recipes for each of those things, right? And um, what I want to do now is I want to talk about adding uh, enchantment effects to this stuff. Yeah. 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 So that way, when you craft them, they come out with a specific enchantment. Um, so let's get started. Let's get started. Um, we are going to do a public, public void on created method and we are going to be calling the item that's created via item stack and we are going to be specifying the world that we're in so world world and we're also going to specify the player so that'll be pretty easy we'll just do any player like so voila um, so really, I mean, it's pretty it's pretty straightforward from here. Um, we're calling in our item stack upon creation, and so really, all we need to do is just do item stack dot uh, add enchantment, and we're going to reference the enchantment class. So enchantment, and then you'll hear you'll see the list of different enchantments that we have available to us. Um, I'll choose unbreaking. And then we're going to choose a level, so like one through five, right? So we'll choose four. Pretty straightforward. And uh, so we'll jump into the game. We'll test this out, see what happens. Don't need this. Um, oh. Yeah, I tuned up my house. Give it a little bit more lighting, a little chandelier. I have doors. <coughs> That's pretty awesome. And then this, we're going to come see this here in a few. Alright, so. Um, we've got our stiff. Right here, our stiff. Um, so let's do this. Let's create a chest piece. Chest piece, we create it. See, we've got our unbreaking for enchantment. Right? Now, the thing is, is everything that we craft is going to have this unbreaking for enchantment. Now, you may want to actually have, or to create these and have different enchantments on each one. Right? So, these are all unbreaking for. So, we're going to kind of jump in and um, a little bit of what we did last night in terms of you know specifying which thing it is um, but what we want to do is we actually we, we more or less we need to get the item that's in that item stack so um, we will do an if let's move this down I like the room if um, item stack dot get item equals um, our uh, helm then what we want to do is we're going to do just like we did before we're going to say item stack dot add enchantment and enchantment dot uh, what do we want to do let's do aqua affinity and aqua affinity is uh, the ability to dig underwater and I think you move a little bit faster and we'll give that a 2, right? Um, and then we can do an else if item stack dot get item equals new crown dot um, and we're going to do the chest this time. So if it equals the chest, what are we going to do? We are going to Copy paste that because we're lazy. And we're going to say, um, 
Oh, what do we want to do? Let's do fire protection. Fire protection. Oh yeah. And Elsif. And we'll just copy and paste this as well. Um, except this is going to be the legs. And we'll copy this and paste this down here. And what do we want this one to be? Let's do, ooh, let's do thorns. Thorns, and you know what? Let's make fire protection a four. Let's make this a five. And it's not legs this time, but the boots. Making the boots. Um, and this will be, um, we'll do a four, and let's do unbreaking on this one. Dot unbreaking. So we've gone through and we've essentially specified what each of these is going to be. Sweet. Uh, let's run it and see what happens. So, this is all of our unbreaking stuff. Let's take a peek here. What was this going to have? Fire protection. Aqua affinity. Oh, I'm just barely going to have enough. Thorns and unbreaking. Four, five, four, two. So just like we specified. Oh, hello there, friend. Welcome. Welcome. All right. Yeah, that looks tacky. So that's really it. Um, you know, I mean, the biggest the biggest challenge is, of course, you know, going through and actually making the armor. Um, adding the enchantments is pretty easy. Um, I looked at adding potion effects, and from the best that I can gather, you can't add potion effects because you add potion effects to the person, not to the item. So I'm going to do a little bit of research on that. And if it comes back that you can actually do that, I will, of course, release an updated video. Um, now we're going to head to the nether. We, that's overdue. We need to head to the nether and uh, do some mining. Some mining in the nether. So I'm going to check out and we're going to go do that. And I'll see you guys then. This is Neil. I'm out.